Hi, I'm Kris Jenner, and I would like to walk you guys through a decade of Kardashian Christmases. Every year, I swear, I'm like five years old. I cannot wait for Christmas morning. I get to give them their presents, and the kids are opening gifts, and here's 2006, right before we started doing Keeping Up with the Kardashians. Kendall and Kylie are definitely very young in this picture. We were living in Calabasas at the time, one of my favorite, favorite shoots because there was really no prep. It was just bring your jeans, bring a white shirt, and we're done. This is 2007. During this year, I was running a children's boutique called Smooch with Courtney and managing Bruce's speaking career. And the girls had their Dash clothing stores. Rob was at USC going to college. And the little girls were in school. So everybody was super busy. Sorry. Hey, Kendall. No. Where were we? I think one of the best stories that I can tell you guys, last year, Courtney decided to take over Christmas morning. And so I had taken all the stockings over to Courtney's house and left him there and said, okay, you're in charge of stockings. There was basically nothing, not even a piece of coal. Then we flipped to 2008. We had Monica Rose style this shot. Every year we have a theme. This year was we were all gonna wear red and the boys were gonna be in suits. And I'm not sure who decided the latter was a good idea, but it was fun. <laughs> She's going up, up, up. Then we flashed to 2009. We were so busy this year because Chloe met Lamar and decided to get married in 30 days. We decided to take one of the wedding pictures taken with Ryan Seacrest and rather than Photoshop him out, we just left him in the card and sent it out. Courtney's pregnant in this photo. I just noticed, that's so cute. So she's pregnant here with Mason. The best gifts they've ever given me are my grandchildren. Brain and Mason, remarkably, are born on the exact same day. I think that every year to be able to celebrate with the babies and the grandchildren, it means more now than I ever thought it would. And that's the biggest gift of all. This is 2010. This was really fun. Instead of a studio or at the beach or something like that, we decided to do one in our entryway. Kim is in charge of glam for the most part and kind of leads the pack on what direction to go in. Kendall, who's always had a love of fashion, obviously, decided to get a little more dark or edgy. And I thought, wow, that's another side of Kendall that I had never seen. So this was a really fun shot. 2011, so this one, this was one of my favorite shots because it's shot in front of my pavilion out by my pool that I love. It's one of my favorite places at my house and just everybody is kind of perfect. I loved this year. This was a shot where I wore this green Dolce & Gabbana dress that I adore. I wish I would have bought it. It was borrowed for the shoot and I love that. And this one, we were all filming in Miami. The cat was Kim's kitty. The kitty's name was Mercy, named after one of Kanye's songs, and the kitty died shortly after that. But this is our 2013 Christmas card, and this was shot by Dave LaChapelle. We did not know what the set on this shoot was gonna look like until we arrived at the studio. And it was a big surprise and it was a big reveal. There was a huge pile of tabloids in the middle of the shot and they were kind of on fire. They put images of Bruce Jenner's career all over the room, which was interesting. Flipping to 2015, because 2014 we might have just run out of time. We were so busy and so much was going on. We didn't shoot anything and everybody was having babies and it was Wild. So we have some great images, but not an official card. Lots of love on this card. So there's North Penelope, Mason, and Rain. Just to do one with the kids meant everything to me. So every time there's a new family member added to our family, whether it's a boyfriend, a husband, a baby, they get their own stocking. This year, I'm not sure what we're doing. We'll just have to wait till Christmas Eve and take one then and share it with you guys in January as a Happy New Year card. Okay. I just want to wish you guys a merry, merry Christmas filled with lots of love, joy, and peace.